Hello, my name is Xia Hui. I'm an engineer on the search team. In this release, we have downloaded a few search improvements for you. First, we made some changes to the search UI. There are now labels showing up next to some of the search results to explain why we think the results are important. We have also added a preview panel so that you can take a glance of the content without having to click onto the results. Second, we have also been iterating our machine learning ranking model for better accuracy. Hope the results are getting more and more relevant for you. Hi, I'm Song Yi from Notion's product marketing team. I'm here to talk about some recent upgrades we made to web publishing. First, we released a new sites tab within the settings menu, a place where you can more easily manage all of your publicly shared pages. Now, SEO indexing is available for everyone, no matter what plan you're on. And lastly, we released new and improved templates to help you get started building your portfolio, resume, travel guide, careers page, and even more. Hi, everyone. I'm Elizabeth on the partnerships team here at Notion, and I'm excited to show you our new Zendesk integration. With this integration, you can preview contents of Zendesk tickets in Notion pages, or even add them as database properties. And in that way, you can enrich documents like your task lists or feedback trackers. Hey everyone, this is Steven from the Databases team. We just shipped database property and view descriptions, which lets you add context that shows up on Hover to your databases in Notion. We hope this small update will help your teams better on board to your Notion workspaces. Hey, my name is Felix, and I'm here on behalf of many engineers who got to work on Notion's performance. We specifically spent the last couple of weeks optimizing how long it takes for Notion pages to load, for databases to show up, for database items to show up, and also how long it takes Notion to respond to one of your key presses. Hi, this is Harsha. We know there's a lot of value in your team's comments on a page, and now they show up in exports. You can include both page level and inline comments when you try exporting in HTML format. Hi, I'm Sachi, and I'm an engineer working on databases at Notion. I shipped a new feature to duplicate the structure of a database without including any of the pages. You'll get all the views, database templates, any automations you have set up, but without any of the content you have stored in the database. Hopefully this makes sharing your awesome database setups and creating templates a bit easier and it'll lead to faster duplication speeds when all you want is to duplicate the structure. Thank you so much.